Hey folks, James Downs. Well, today ain't looking good for fishing on the old lunch break. We're about to get rained out. I jumped in the car, headed down there. Man, there's some dark black clouds coming in. Looks like we got rain for the rest of the day. I checked the radar and it ain't gonna happen today. But uh, most days like this, what I do is I work on uh, getting my tackle prepared. What I do is I'll go ahead and get some uh, some leader lines hooked up to some swivels and, and, and the hooks and everything and just kind of do some lines up. And I've got a little case that I put everything in. It's about that big around. And uh, I put two or three of uh, different kind of leaders, hooks, swivels in each case I already made up. That way, you know, I use snap swivels a lot on my poles. And that way, if I'm going to do any bait fishing or I can go to catching, you know, catfish in the river and just you know drop of a hook <laughs> drop of a hat but uh anyway i think that may be what i do today i normally don't film that but i figured with uh look like rain today probably rain tomorrow so in order to get something on here i think we're gonna do some uh some terminal tackle tying and there, there may be some folks out there that I ain't never tied a leader line to a, what in the world? I'm sitting over here by Whittington Park and there's some uh, less desirables walking around. Anyway, there may be some folks that's uh, never tied a leader line to a main line or mono to uh, to your uh, braid. I don't normally use braid. I've got one pole that I got braid on, and that's the one that I use for brim fishing. That's about it. That's the only braid I buy. I don't use braid on anything else. I just, it's too stiff, and um, it just, it, it ain't my favorite. I, I, I'm a monofilament guy. I, I, that's that's my go-to. But um, anyway, we're going to do some knots and tie some lines and hope for better days of fishing. 